We have big news coming in from the Supreme Court. Supreme Court holds Prashant Bhushan guilty of contempt of court. Hearing on the quantum of punishment to be held on August 20th, Prashant Bhushan found guilty of contempt for his tweets on CJI Bob Day and his tweets on previous four CJIs. Here's Prashant Bhushan there, found guilty now for contempt of court. We have Anisha joining us, joining us for more details on that live. Anisha, Supreme Court there holding Prashant Bhushan guilty of contempt of court. Hearing on the quantum of punishment to be held on 20th of August. What more do we know? What uh, details has the court revealed there based on the tweets that Prashant Bhushan has put out on the Chief Justice of India and also the previous uh, four Chief Justices? Well, Nabila, this is big trouble coming in for Prashant Bhushan. Remember, the Supreme Court had taken so much cognizance of uh, his tweets regarding the Chief Justice of India, Saradarvin uh, Bobde, and uh, tweets regarding uh, the four previous judges. This is now the second case in which uh, this is now, uh, while this is the first time he's been held guilty of contempt, this is the second case which was initiated against him. Uh, for contempt of court, for uh, speaking out against the court. What is also very important is that he had received quite a lot of uh, support from other lawyers and civil society members. There were letters sent to the Supreme Court. There were uh, uh, representations sent uh, uh, to the court uh, saying that ple uh, please don't uh, punish him for criticizing the judiciary. He had, in fact, during the he uh, hearing, uh, senior advocate Dushan Dave had even argued that criticism of the uh, of the conduct of judges should not be seen as uh, contempt of court itself. However, the court does not seem to have accepted this argument uh, and has held uh, Prashant Bhushan uh, has said that uh, Prashant Bhushan is guilty of contempt of court for these particular tweets. What is also important is that in the second contempt case, which was initiated in 2009 for his interview given to a magazine, in that one also the Supreme Court has not accepted his explanation and will continue to hear him. So it is very clear that the court is going to take uh, some uh, action against Prashant Bhushan. Remember, he has been a very, very vocal critic of uh, what we uh, of the reports we've right. seen coming out from the judiciary regarding the judges, regarding the way the judiciary is working. And he has been uh, very, very sta uh, staunch in his criticism, saying that the, uh, the judiciary cannot be something that is uncriticizable. However, this now seems to be coming right. back to Absolutely. Him. Uh, he's been pulled up there, the court observing that Prashant Bhushan there guilty for contempt of court. Thank you very much, Anisha, for joining us with those details.